so much trouble with this. Got me stuck. <laughs> so guys, welcome everyone back to another YouTube video. Now, again, today's video, we're going to be finally doing some exhaust modifications on my M140i. Now, I've got Luke's M140i here. He's a good mate of mine. I'll leave his Instagram uh, in the description down below. I'm coming to his garage because he is going to help me fit a sports cat from Puma Speed. Now, it's a 200 set one. I just want to say a massive thank you to them to, for sending it out um, for the video. We're going to do the sports cat here, and then we're going to go to Pads Fab, who did the previous double res delete on my M140i, and he's going to do it on this one as well. So, so today we're going to just do the sports cap and what we'll do then is we'll cut to when I get the double res delete but other than that what we're going to do here is I'm going to get Luke to give me a first sort of like rev because he's got the double res delete and he's also got the Puma Speed sports cat so whenever you're ready give it a rev and I want to get my first sort of reaction I'm, this is what mine's going to sound like <laughs> It's, it's loud enough, isn't it? It's oh loud my enough. God! <laughs> I did not expect that. No, I'm not even you don't joking. Expect it on idle. As soon as you put your foot down, that's it. That is ridiculous. Yeah. I expect that to be like decat sound. That's literally sports. And that cat. is fully legal as well. That's yeah, fully legal. Fully legal. That mate, is that? Have you Matt popped into that? No, that's literally with the map. I am. Wow. Oh. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Boys and girls, I am proud to announce this video has been kindly sponsored by the guys over at Cloudburst. Now, if you've been watching the channel for a while, you'll know exactly what they are. But if you don't, let me quickly explain. So Cloudburst are the high pressure odor eliminator company that basically supply air fresheners, which you can use in your office, home, shoes, clothing, all sorts of places. Now I've been using these three for an awful long time. I've had loads and loads of sprays for them and I've been using them when I clean my cars and also when I clean my room and stuff like that. And it just makes the house look really nice. They used to just have Sauvage, Creed and Million and now they brought out a new range. So the new scents are Amani Code, Kenzo Flowers and Tom Ford Ombre Leather. Now this is proper exciting because I've been using these products for an awful long time so now it's just nice to try some new scents and also you guys have been buying the old scents so by all means go ahead and check out the new scents as well. And if you do go ahead and buy them and use them make sure you tag me on your Instagram stories and I'll be sure to repost them. But also I'd like to know what you guys think about these products. And not only have they brought out more sprays they've also introduced a new range of candles. So this one here that is the Tom Ford Tobacco Vanilla I think is what you say and basically if I open it up inside you've got a luxury candle which smells bloody lovely. I'm definitely gonna light that tonight and see what it's like. They also do a black opium one and Dior Sauvage one as well, so I can imagine they are really nice as well. I'd like to see what the Dior Sauvage one is like, to be fair. Well, once again, a massive thank you to Cloudburst for sponsoring today's video. I really do appreciate the support. Honestly, the support that these guys give on the channel is really, really good, and I really do appreciate it a lot. Now, you can buy them in a bundle, which makes it a little bit cheaper, and also, if you use code BB10, you get it even cheaper as well. But anyway, make sure you go check them out, use code BB10, and uh, yeah, let's get back into the video. So Luke is getting started on the car over there. I'm gonna help him in a moment, but for now, this is the sports car I've gone for. So it's a pure speed one, and it's got 200 cells in it, and I've also got, from ML Performance, a new gasket. Luke didn't need it on his, but I basically was recommended to get one just in case. So a massive thank you to Puma Speed for sending it out. I'll leave all links and stuff in the description down below. Um, and obviously you've already heard it because it's on Luke's. Um, but yeah, I got this because Luke recommended it basically. So uh, thanks to him for the sort of recommendation. But yeah, it should be a fairly easy job. Now it'll be interesting to see what the difference is with just a standard exhaust and a sports cat. Because obviously Luke did have his just like, like just with a sports cat first for like a week or so. So it'll be interesting to see what it sounds like. Probably just a little bit louder, but nothing too special. Try it, try it. Boys and girls, the sports car is now in. So we did have a few troubles, but only like troubles with the car and rusty bolts and stuff like that. But the fitment of the Puma Speed sports car, it seems to be absolutely fantastic. Hence why Luke recommended it. But anyway, Luke, whenever you're ready, turn her on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, 
let it warm up and then we'll do some burbles and stuff like that. So the car is now warm. Let's see what it's going to sound like with just the sports cap. Go on, when, when you're ready. That is much better. It, the thing is, I'm just disappointed because of how good your sound. I really need to get the Dolores delete. It, it, it it's, it's deeper, isn't it? Yeah. So boys and girls, it is now a week later and obviously we had the sports cap just installed as you would have just seen and uh, to be fair, I've been absolutely loving it. It's a lot, you probably hear it now to be fair, it is a lot louder, like a lot louder on cold start and it also that burbles a lot more, it pops a lot more and it just is louder overall. Now I wouldn't say it's quite as loud as my old double res delete but I can imagine what when you put the sports cat and the double res delete together it's going to be stupidly loud so I can't wait. Anyway we are on the way to Pads Fab, I've got currently 45 minutes left uh, of the drive. He's based in Cambon here in Cornwall. But yeah I'm super super excited to see what this is going to be like. I feel like this is going to transform the car. Boys and girls, the car is now done. Now I just want to say a massive, massive thank you to Pads Fab for basically sorting all this out. Honestly, his work is proper amazing, hence why I've gone back the second time. But if you do want to go ahead and watch the first video, I'll leave a link in the description and also one of the cards on screen as well. But uh, yeah, I think enough rambling. I haven't I haven't actually moved the car once yet. I've just pulled it out of the garage and yeah, I haven't even put it in Sport Plus yet. So Let's see, so we put up windows a little bit because it don't be too, too drafty. Let's just see what it sounds like. I'm honestly super buzzing. I know I've heard it before, but it's different when it's your own car. All right, here we go. Oh my God, that is so asbo. That is stupid. That is stupid. Oh my god. That sounds so cool. <laughs> oh my god. That is ridiculous. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh! I'm gonna get into so much trouble with this. <laughs> so boys and girls, one thing I was a little bit worried about is potentially the drone. Now we're currently sat exactly Wait a minute. We're currently sat at exactly 70 mile an hour, and I wouldn't say it's much difference. I wouldn't say there's a lot in it. Obviously, we're in comfort as well, so the, the, the exhaust flap's shut. It's not, there's not a lot in it. I think it's basically just as quiet, which is perfect for what I want. I wanted to be able to do both, basically, but this is absolutely ridiculously cool. Like, I am over the moon. I'm kind of speechless, I'm not even joking. I, I don't even know how to react because I've never had a car with a loud exhaust like this ever and it, it, it just sounds so cool. It's a little bit raspy, a little bit sort of like high pitch some would say but in the future sort of in like six to eight months time or whatever I'm going to probably invest in a Remus catback non-resonated um, non exhaust anyway so this was like a real cheap way of getting a lot of noise and there's not one thing in me that's wanting a different sound right now this sounds ridiculously aggressive and it pops and bangs loads considering this is standard obviously we took the map off it's a completely standard car ridiculous so uh but yeah 
Anyway, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end the video right there because I'm probably gonna do a POV drive with the new exhaust over the next couple of days. So look out for that in the next few videos. But once again, a massive thank you to PadsFab for basically getting the double res delete done. And also a massive thank you to Puma Speed for the sports cat. And also we cannot forget Luke, that M140i BM on Instagram for the help installing the cat. Um, I probably could have done it on my own. Well, I wouldn't be able to do it without his ramp for one. And also he did, he's already done it before. So uh, it was just nice to have uh, a mate to help me do it. But please go ahead and uh, leave a like, rate and comment and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. But other than that, I shall catch you guys very, very soon in a brand new video. I freaking love this thing now. <laughs>